55 watt CPUs uh, in a mobile workstation. So using the new 12th gen Intel HX processor. Coupling that with same graphics capability here, RTX uh, A5500 16 gig graphics card. But now I have even more expandability. Everything's toolless access, but I've got four DIMM slots and I've got four storage. So I can do 128 gigs of RAM, I can do 12 terabytes of storage. Couple that with a 4K display, a desktop processor, I can do 4K video footage and do editing, rendering on the fly. So think of education or public sector. I'm a student and I'm doing a STEAM curriculum. I'm learning to be the next generation data science, the next generation artist, the next generation product developer. I need all that performance. I need all those ISV certifications, but I'm still on my parents' budget. No speakers on the chin or up top. They still sound amazing. Both of these are 23.8 inch quad HD. They have 90 Hertz refresh rate. The Z24M is a USB-C monitor. Do up to hundred watts of charging for the notebook. Uh, you can also display port daisy chain to the second screen, add all your peripherals on it, so it really becomes the hub of your workspace. This has a proximity sensor built into it. You're here, you're in front of the monitor, you walk away, it's going to lock your PC, it's going to put the monitor to sleep. HP Z40C, this is a Thunderbolt monitor, 4K webcam, 40 inch 5K 2K. So here you see I've got like a 16 by nine video playing. I've still got all this space for other applications. So full performance of a desktop workstation in a mini form factor. So being able to use i5, i7, i9 K series processors, being able to go up to an RTX uh, A2000 class graphics, 64 gig of memory, being able to output to eight external displays, but, but small enough to be on a desk, small enough to mount behind a display or Visa mount behind a desk. So the ZBook Studio here, it's got an uh, RTX card, it's super powerful. 100 watts, will it'll charge it, but it's not gonna be full performance. So if you're doing editing workflows, you're, you're really getting into it, you need more power. So we actually have the new Thunderbolt G4 dock. This is a 280 watt version. It can actually do up to 230 watts of charging. So that's enough for any ZBook with discrete graphics. So a ton of power. 